Welcome back to my little corner of the internet. It is Easter Sunday today, but it's also moving day. So for today's video, it's going to be my moving vlog. And I'll give y'all a tour of my new apartment. But since it's Easter Sunday, we stopped by my partner's sister's house to watch her kids hunt for Easter eggs. That's what they just did in the backyard. And I think we're about to be off to my house to start loading everything up. This move was the first time that I actually had a long period of time to move, which has been super nice. I do have to be out of this apartment by tomorrow, but most of the stuff is already moved. And now we just have to get the furniture and the big shit, which should be real easy. It should take one trip without having to rent a U-Haul. Best move ever. And also I'm moving in with my partner. So most of my videos have been in the apartment that I'm moving into, but I haven't given y'all an official apartment tour. So I want to put that together for this video. All right, little Easter activity is done. And we're going to my house. This morning we didn't have time for breakfast, so I think we're gonna stop and grab a Soylent. I really like Soylent. I know some people are like weirded out by it and don't like it, but we, we drink them all the time. They're super quick and easy for when we don't have time for breakfast. And they actually are filling. tomorrow and clean but saying goodbye to this tiny studio apartment love the location thought I could handle how tiny it was turns out no but that's okay I tried it and on this minimalist journey tiny home living is not for me Oh, 
messed up. And my dad's truck's full of furniture behind us. We've never tried it before. It's supposed to be vegan fried chicken. Definitely looks like fast food. Not super excited about that, but it's vegan, so I hope it tastes good. I got the spicy one, he got the regular one. The fries are pretty good, we've already been eating those. And then we got pastry from Zucchini Kill, because Zucchini Kill is amazing and delicious. Try this burger. Or fried spicy fried chicken sandwich. Sorry. It's not as crispy as I was hoping. Maybe that's because the spicy sauce is tossed in. But it's still pretty good. Okay, so it's the next day, and it's very echoey in here. With nothing in it. I just finished cleaning, I'm about to go turn in the keys, so we are saying goodbye to this tiny, dark cave apartment that has such a great location, but is not exactly what I want. Goodbye, tiny kitchen.
calendar and how your life is intertwined with one or more people already. Generally a nesting partner means that your life is a little more intertwined than maybe some of your other partners. Splitting bills, splitting household chores, stuff like that. So it's a way for me to say, to, it's a way for me to talk about my partner with anybody I might be on a date with. I really liked living alone, so it's been interesting to live with a partner, but I will go into all of that and how we, and how we work through little conflicts that come up in my future apartment tour video. And I'll go ahead and end this here. Thank y'all for watching. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram and Twitter and LinkedIn and all those other places. And I hope y'all have a great day. I am the Vegan Rainbow. Thanks for watching. Bye y'all.